All right, it's time to meet this week's second chance pet. Get ready for your daily dose of adorable. This Aww. is Jermaine, a Newfoundland, Newfoundland mix pup estimated to be about nine weeks old. Wow, we're told he's one of the sweetest pups you'll ever meet and just wants to be snuggled. But of course, since he's so young, he needs to go to a family that's willing to train him. So joining us live to introduce us to Jermaine, we have our friend Sam Ellingson with the Humane Society for Southwest Washington. That is a big puppers there, Sam. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I mean, listen, at nine weeks, this dog already outweighs my dog. So <laughs> certainly any family who brings him home, uh, they're going to be very lucky because he is an incredibly sweet dog. And they're also going to have their hands full because he's going to be a big boy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that can be one of the fun surprises of adopting a puppy from a shelter is you don't always know what all is mixed into that sure. mix. So how big he will be, who's to say? But he looks like he is a real cute, snuggly guy. Yeah, he really is. So we've been having a lot of playtime this morning, and I, I tried to wear him out a little bit so we could get some snuggle time before the segment started. But I think as most people um, can imagine, there isn't really any way to wear out a puppy, um, <laughs> especially when you only have a few minutes with them. So he's he's gonna uh, he's gonna make the best of me. But you know what? I think we're gonna be I think we're gonna be just fine. Yeah. Well, I will say I, my uh, uh, cousin, my uncle, he has a he has a Newfoundland, oh. and uh, I mean she's just the sweetest. But they are big dogs, so mm -hmm. it won't be too long until I'm sure Jermaine is not able to crawl up into your lap there, Sam, uh, oh, he'll to get still those try. snuggles. He will. He'll be. He crushed. will. He'll forget that he's not a <laughs> lap dog. Um, but describe describe his personality for us. Yeah. So Jermaine is actually an incredibly sweet little guy. He's very very social. So sometimes when we have puppies in the shelter, you know. They can get a little bit overwhelmed. This is this is a new space. This is a really active place, and that can be a little too much for some puppies. But Jermaine has really just been rolling with it. As you can see, he's incredibly friendly and incredibly social. He likes to play. He likes to snuggle. He likes to just spend time with people. So the few times that I have been able to um, get into his kennel with him, he's been incredibly eager to say hi. And Aww. the first thing that he wants to do is crawl up on your lap. Um, and so that's what we, that's mostly what we know about him. He seems pretty darn gentle. He seems pretty happy go lucky. So we think he's going to make a pretty easy transition into the, the home of whichever lucky family is ready to take him home. Yeah, it sounds like it. And of course, like these are, you know, the, the puppy, the puppy years, because there really are about two of them, uh, two to three, where they have that puppy energy. But this time can be so important for that training and socialization. So if someone's interested in taking home a puppy, what can they expect, especially in those first few months? Yeah, of course. And so these, you know, these rules are going to apply to Jermaine. They're going to apply to any of the puppies who come home uh, who are adopted. So they should expect that just like a human baby, these guys are learning everything when they come home. So all of these experiences are going to be new for them. Things that they can touch, things that they can't touch, you know, things that are okay to chew on, things that are not okay to chew on, potty training, socialization, all of those things are going to be critical for any puppy who goes home because this is really the time that you have the opportunity to invest in their training and their socialization, make it easier as they get older and as they get bigger. So taking them to, <laughs> taking them to <laughs> classes, taking them out with you, getting them used to seeing new people, new sounds, new dogs, all of those different things, those are all going to be essential for their, for their socialization and for their ability to adapt. And we do have training classes here at the Humane Society too. So any family who wants to adopt a puppy, um, that's gonna be a great opportunity for them to just sign up for just something as simple as puppy socialization classes. Where you know you can do this with them at home, but to get them in a room with a bunch of other puppies where they can play and explore and learn together is a great opportunity. Yeah, absolutely. And then hopefully they'll come home tired for at least a little yeah, bit. Maybe for yeah. just a, maybe for a little bit, maybe for a little bit. And well, right. so before before we let you go, it sounds like Jermaine, one of 16 puppies looking for homes right Ooh. now. So plenty of puppies to go check out. Yeah, absolutely. You know, I um, I think Jermaine is just an, is enough for me for a segment. I considered bringing on a few more, but fortunately, I, I, I thought better and figured we'd just focus on this one dog for right now. But you're right. We have 16 puppies looking for homes, and it's a great time to adopt right now when you have time, especially if you have kids at home who can help you uh, train that puppy and get that puppy used to being at home. It's, a, it's an excellent time to adopt. Yeah, yeah summer can a lot be of a, sense. an easier time for some families to, to get into that new routine. Mm -hmm. Well, Aww. Jermaine, enjoy yeah. your lap snuggles while you can get them, bud, yeah. because it won't be too <laughs> long until you force your way under that lap as a bigger pooch there. Aww. <laughs> Sam, thanks so much for introducing us to Jermaine. He's a cutie. 
Thank you for having us. We Absolutely. appreciate it. Absolutely. And if you want to meet Jermaine or his 15 other equally <laughs> adorable young friends, you can check out all of the pets available up for adoption right now at hssw.org.